Chapter 17 of Baki Rahen, A Hanma's Praise. For now, we are presently in the Tokugawa Estates, where Tokugawa questions up against Jack Hanma. Would even Baki Hanma have a hope of winning? Baki then looks up in deep thoughts while the noble elder smokes his pipe. Sure was a refreshing sight, huh? Just get stronger, just win. He's utterly uninterested in how others see him. Which is exactly true. It's like, remember how the underground arena staff member Matsuo said to Jack in the um, fighter's room? It's like you have no shame while Jack was taking his drugs. That's how he mentioned how Jack was taking the drugs. Like he had no shame. Like he was indifferent to how others people were perceiving Jack himself. Conjoining that with what Tokugawa says here, he's utterly uninterested in how others see him, which is very, very true. I wonder about that. After my brother's match with Tsukune, it sure seemed like he was soaking up the crowd. I'm not really sure if it's a new thing that Jack was always... He always liked to see himself as a star. Always liked the, the attention. I think we do see the like the magnitude of it, of, of how much Jack loves attention in the Tsukune fight. Like this panel here, I think it was redrawn. I think Itagaki redrew it. But if it wasn't, I'll just put the, uh, the original right next to this one on the screen. And another case would be when Baki was fighting Yujiro and Jack saw the fight on television. He was like, okay, there's different dialogues of it. But I think the main, the mainly accurate one would be, it should have been me or that should be me somewhere around those lines because near, like everyone in japan was looking at that fight where they were viewing it online in real life and jack he wanted the attention as well and that would really go to show how much jack wants to consider himself like the star of the show all awash in that sea of cheers he couldn't hide that look of pure bliss because he loves it it's like he gets strength off its people's cheering. Even though a few of his fights are not viewed by an, a big audience, They're may, they could be in a quiet parking lot, in a phone booth, or even just with one or two persons looking. Even in the maximum tournament, Jack didn't seem like he enjoyed the, the crowds and spectators rejoicing all that much. So I think, as the story went on, he grew more and more into that type of mm, extroverted person that would enjoy an audience or the crowd cheering him on. And that would bring him pure ecstasy, is what I would imagine, just by the look on his face. Mmm, that's true. Even he'd like a little praise. Especially if it comes from Yujiro Hanma. That is something he wants, no matter the cost. Does Baki know that has already happened? The whole chapter of Jack getting praise from his dear father, Yujiro Hanma. I'm not sure if Baki is aware of that. But he is right that Jack would... I think only a few things Jack would love more than getting praise, especially if it's from his father, as Baki already explained. As Tokugawa smokes some more from his pipe. Interesting. How very simple. If only his father'd give him a pet. It wouldn't matter if he drew the world's ire. Ire means anger. So Tokugawa is saying to us here it wouldn't matter if the world was angry at jack if his father would give him a pet which i don't know what he means by that like an animal you're two peas in a pod ain't you next we see a high view of the shin shin kai dojo where a wide wide figured dopo like dopo is just too he looks too good he always looks good 
so musk so muscular even with his gi on and he's holding a plastic bag accompanied with his son katsumi <laughs> well made these bags with this it's a lot harder with a person katsumi is impressed by dopo practicing with this plastic bag following that we have more panels of dopo basically juggling the bag with his hand his foot and even his head until he blows the bag up in the air with his breath and this plastic bag type of training it's what katsumi does and i think the purpose of it would be to help you determine your own power like based on your strikes to the plastic bag or you could just use it to display how good you are at slicing something that's that's not as dense or that could easily flow away from you because a plastic bag wouldn't be an easy thing to chop since it's not in suspended animation it's flowing around the air but anyways anyways dopo jumps and with pristine form kicks the bag slicing it into two whoa <laughs> lands on the ground and showing off his heaven and earth stance shouting seiya man katsumi looks so proud of his father here seiya eh bet if you asked jack he'd call it unnecessary and he gives off a sigh of relief so you're saying that was necessary it's what makes karate karate and i was questioning myself what does dopo mean by that exactly zanshin that is to stress an important scene or moment a kabuki actor will strike a pose their mie this is karate's mie that makes sense i put the meaning of these words zanshin kabuki on the screen so you could know exactly what it means in correlation to karate's mie yeah, and tell me what you think about it in the comments if you want to that's godao or whatever it just got started up recently he shouldn't be acting like such a know-it-all a truly great answer wow like we're on the third location of this one chapter and this location it's a very it's a very historical one because it's the same hotel or restaurant that the father-son arc fights occurred in and the very the same waiter that works in this establishment is now seen catering the two hanmas father and son yujiro and jack has your sight returned yujiro asks jack as he looks at his son with like a caring tone i'm guessing because he's asking him politely has your sight returned such a stiff expression <laughs> jack's sweating he says um eat some softer food every now and then and while yujiro is, is saying here that jack he's kind of saying that jack looks too serious here such a stiff expression <laughs> i just i just wonder what this will lead to in the next chapter i hope there's no break next week the strong is the beautiful.